Hi everyone, it's Jenea. Uh, I just wanted to come on and do a project share. I'm taking part in a binder swap, so I was just going to take a video of that, and I'm going to wait to post this until the person I'm sending this to receives it, but I just wanted to share it before I send it off. So first I just have this little gift bag that I made, and in it I put some of these pom-pom paper clips. Um, this was a Maggie Holmes themed binder swap and I just thought that these colors went really well with the Bloom collection which is the one that I used for this. And then I just added a little bag topper there. And here's my binder. Um, I stitched all around most things in this um, most of my embellishments and most of the things I've added to this binder. On the spine I use some of this trim from Hobby Lobby and Mint. And the back is just plain. Um, I am going to put a little Handmade by Jenea um, on the back here somewhere. Or something similar to that. And then I have a tassel that I made here. Just using a bunch of different trims and a little bow. In the closure, I use seam binding from um, my scrap cabin shop, I believe is the name of it. And here's the inside. So to hang the um, tassel, I used one of those like phone rings that you put on the back of your phone. And then I just put washi on the top and bottom from the Bloom collection to kind of tie it together. And everything I added on the pocket that I made is um, I used removable glue dots, including this, so that instead of just being decoration, the receiver of this can just take those off and use them how she wants. And in here I just have some of those... Um, Ruffle trims that Vintage Goose did a tutorial on, and I just put some of those in there. And I made a rosette and did some decorating on that one. And I just left these rosette ribbons plain. And then on the first page, I have some rosette ribbons that I embellished. So they're all ready to go to put on a project. Hopefully you can see. In here I just chose some colors that go well with the Bloom collection and I made some Maggie Holmes inspired little bows. Um, Crafting with Liller actually has a tutorial on how to do this and it's super simple and she makes it really easy to follow along. I did make mine a little different than her, but they're based off of her tutorial. So. And then here I have some flat, um, flatter embellishments. And these tickets are, they're separate from each other, but I just put them together um, for the look of it. But she can take those off and use them how she chooses. Like I said, everything's attached with removable glue dots. And my partner said that she does like having stuff for layering. So I thought those would come in handy. And then here I have some um, just little shaker cards that I embellished. And those are made out of, I backed them with 110 pound cardstock. And then I used some paper from the Bloom collection and a sequence mix, and I, um, I use tool on top. On the next page here, um, these are inspired by Snail Mail Maddie, and um, I believe she's Madison Daisy on YouTube. I'll link her channel below, but she was making a ton of these vellum shakers, and I just thought they were super cute. And especially how soft the vellum makes everything look with the Bloom collection. I thought that looked really nice. 
And then here I have wrapped some of the embroidery thread around some tickets. And here I just kind of did my own thing and made up some little embellishments. And I really liked the way those turned out. These two are separate from each other. And here I embellished some crepe paper rosettes that I made. And again, I have embroidery thread around some tickets. And on the last page, there's more of the ruffle trim. Um, I used some vellum and then I used paper from the Bloom collection. And on the back, there's another pocket. And again, I just placed these two things with removable glue dots. And there's a crepe paper rosette and one of the rosette ribbons. And I also made some more um, different sized gift bags. And I added some tickets. So yeah, that's my binder swap. I'm super excited for my partner to receive this, and I hope she enjoys it. Um, I had a lot of fun making a whole lot of new things in this swap. Thank you for watching. Have a great day, and I'll see you next time.